Marriott Corporation. That's right. I saw Marriott Corporation. I said, man, I want to work there. I want to go there and work. I was already working in the food department. And I said, look, I can do this. And so I went to talk to the human resources and they said, there's no openings uh, in that department right now. But I went over into the department and I noticed there was no uh, African-American in there. So I went and talked to the manager. He said, there's no openings right now. I said, but I want to work here. I said, matter of fact, you would do justice by hiring me to work for you because I will turn this department around. He said, what makes you think you could do that? I said, I've seen what you guys do. I know what I can do. He said, well, there's no opening. So he gave me his card. I left. The next day, guess what I did? I called him. He answered the phone. I said, this is Anthony Shannon. I'm calling for that position. He said, there's no positions. I said, okay, but it will be. He said, I'll let you know. I'll call you. I said, okay. I left. The next day, I emailed him. And guess what else? I called him. He answered. He said, didn't I tell you there's no openings? I said, yes, you did. I said, but I want you to understand how serious I am about getting a position here. He said, well, Anthony, listen, there is no positions opening. Matter of fact, there probably won't be any. So you might as well just hold on. I'll call you if so. I said, no problem. I promise you two days. I let two days go by. I said, probably getting on his nerves. So two days later, I called him on the phone. His secretary said, oh, he's busy. I said, no problem. What time he go to lunch? She told me. I went up to the lunch, bought him lunch. He said, what are you doing? I said, I come to get the job. He said, Anthony, there is no positions. I hear you. I said, I just want you to know this is the place I need to work. I know I'm going to work here. I'm going to do a fantastic job. He said, I tell you what, I know one thing. You show our persistent. I said, good. Two days later, I knocked on the door again. He was leaving and I caught him. I said, I come to get the position. He said, there is no positions available. 45 days later, I didn't call him like I normally call him on a Monday. Tuesday came. I was getting ready to call him and the phone rang. It was him, Mr. Johnson. I said, Anthony Shannon? Yes, sir. He said, guess what? I have a position open for you. You still want it? Absolutely. What do I need to do? I did everything he asked me to do. I was hired on the spot. I want you to know they put me in the worst area, but guess what? After six months, it was the number one spot. It was an amazing thing. They put me in lights. They put me in their newsletter. And all he could tell people at the, at the meeting was, tell them, Anthony, how you got this job. I told him and he said, persistence is the key. And I'm telling anybody else out there, whatever you want, never hear no. But count the no's and the yeses will follow. I got in with Marriott and was very successful in Marriott. And that's my story. Oh, my God.